fashion through the lens of Chris Moore. His face can be seen crouching by the catwalk, camera in hand. He's the Geordie who captures Couture. It is a crazy world, but um, you don't get bored. You never get bored. Chris Moore's been covering the collection since the 1960s, but only now is his work being shown at Bose Museum in Barnard Castle, alongside some of the actual outfits he photographed. Versace. That's Versace. I think, I'm not sure if that might be... I don't know who that is. It looks like Chanel to me. Yeah, I think it is Chanel. London, Paris, Milan, New York. It's a world away from his humble Tyneside beginnings. His family moved down south when he was four. My father was a butcher and my mother, um, I think, was a cook at that time. And they seek their fortune in the south. But I feel that um, once a Geordie, always a Geordie. And it went with us, as it were. So what's it like being back up north? Oh, I love it. When the, when the train goes over the bridges at the time at Newcastle, it gives a lump, it puts a lump in my throat. For the fashion editor, seeing that everything's just right, the model strikes a pose. His career began more by accident than design. Age 20, he began working at Vogue Studios as an assistant to the likes of Cecil Beaton. My father actually got me a job in it with a printing, uh, block making company uh, just off Fleet Street. And I arrived on the Monday morning, not really knowing what I was doing. And I got ushered into a photographic studio and I, I just loved it every minute of it. And the rest is history. Yes, why I. <laughs> the exhibition is really two exhibitions rolled into one. Not only is it a collection of amazing fashion moments by Chris Moore, but also 40 of the world's leading fashion houses have loaned 20 iconic outfits to showcase alongside his work. In the end, we were actually getting too, too, many, too many things to be able to cope with. So we've ended up filling three galleries. So when you see your photographs displayed like this, your work right. over six decades, how does that make you feel? Well, it makes me feel very proud. And um, it's, it's really rather lovely. And the fact that they're being displayed here at Bowes in your native northeast, that yes. must feel really good. Absolutely wonderful. Wonderful. Yes. I'm just sorry that my parents aren't alive to they'd be blown away. Not least by the fact their son is a legendary lensman in his eighties and still in demand on the runway. What would be your next assignment? It is would it autumn be winter? Autumn I don't know. winter. Autumn, autumn winter's winter, next. Ready to wear. That is right. Yes. That's what you're doing next. That's what I'm doing next. You're never far away from a catwalk, are you? No, I'm never far away from a catwalk. <laughs> or a wonderful model. <laughs> Life is good, Chris. Life is very good. <laughs>